Hello guys, Dan here with Let's Fix It. You ever had one of these problems? This vacuum cleaner. <laughs> it won't lock. Won't stay up. It'll stand up. But it won't stay up. I'll show you what to do about that. On this vacuum cleaner, this is your foot release. And these things wear out. So what I'm gonna do is replace this, and I'll show you the steps to go through on how to do that. See, it just, it doesn't lock. If it locked, this thing would tilt up like that every time. So, I'll show you how to replace that latch. The first thing we're gonna do, turn this over to its back, and you'll see right here, this is the latch that actually keeps this thing in place. Inside of here, if you can see past all those cobwebs in there, there's two plastic retainer clips. See if I can hold the light and hold this at the same time. Right on the side here, there's a plastic retainer right here, and then there's another one on this side. And what I wanna do is put a screwdriver on both of those and pry them open. I don't want to do it too hard because it'll break these little clips inside of here. So I'll put one on one side, one on the other, and I'll slowly squeeze them together with one hand so that I can pull the release out. All right, so what I've done is went ahead and put a screwdriver on one side of that little tab right there. I got this screwdriver on the other side and I just want to pull these into each other so that it releases the buttons. It'd be tough to see so that I can pull that little latch out. And that's all there is. There's the broken one. That tab's supposed to be way down here. So let me pull the new one out of the packet show you what it looks like compared to the old one and then I'll show you how to reinsert that latch with a little foot release lever back to this vacuum cleaner all right so you can see here's our old latch you can see how much shorter this little spring here is this one is broken off this one is like it's supposed to be and that's the problem of why this vacuum cleaner won't stand up Putting it back together is really simple. And to do that, I'm going to go ahead and stand up the vacuum cleaner. Foot release. Now I'm gonna go ahead and slip it into place. Let me set you down here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and set it into position. Now, all these little tabs right here on both sides should line right up. This little piece here connects with a little slot there. So we'll slide it in and it snaps in place. Just like that. And that's how simple it is to replace the foot release on your Bissell upright vacuum cleaner. So now the next job on this vacuum cleaner is to go ahead and clean it all up. It's very dirty go ahead and empty the trays out blow all the filter system out of it clean the hose up clean the cord up we'll make this vacuum cleaner look new or as close to new as we can get 